All right, we're gonna show you how to um, prep a foot for any of the Easy Care shoes that attach to the dorsal wall. So we have several different shoe models. We have the uh, Versa Grip Blue, we have the Speed, we have the Octo, and we have the Race and Roller. Just have the roller here today. All these shoes that go to the vertical wall, um, we'll show you how to prep the foot. So let me move these out of the way. So tool-wise, you're gonna need uh, a wire brush, a, uh, a little torch, and then either a buffy or a rasp. These will, these are, um, you can substitute either one. So I've already kind of cleaned these up a little bit. We'll, we'll go back through the procedure. So first thing we're, we're gonna wanna do is, um, is I like to use the, and I'll, I'll actually use both, both the buffy and um, the uh, rasp here. So. When using the Buffy, we want the Buffy to always go down. This removes material. So, again, we don't want to lose, remove a lot of foot. We just want to make it rough, dry, and clean. So that's about all we want to do. And then on the other side, I'll use the other side with my rasp to show you what the difference is. So, and again, we're just trying to rough, rough and dry and clean. So now we have it rough and clean. Next step is three times with wire brush, three times with torch. So what happens, we do this, we can usually, if the light's correct, we can see the dust coming off. So we're gonna do torch again. And again, rough, dry, and clean. A lot of people question the uh, Buffy. And you can see we hardly took any material. So third time here. Go for a last go. Getting some wind. All right, last time here. By the time we do it three times, we are rough, dry, and clean. And again, this is for any of our, oh, I'm bleeding. Let me get that out of there. There we go, rough, dry, clean. All right, now we're gonna show you how to put on the Easy Shoe Roller. And this is really the same technique as the Easy Shoe Grip Glue or the Versus Speed. So I we prepped the foot we've sized them and now we're going to slip them on so the beautiful thing about all these shoes is that the way that um, um, they they fit on the foot so when we get this slid on in square to the world this isn't moving anywhere and it's actually hard for me to twist or turn so now you're really safe to do whatever you want with this foot and even if the horse twists he's not going to twist out of it so the other thing i'm going to do today is i'm going to use i'm going to color coordinate my glue so I'm gonna use the Easy Shoe Adhesive and Repair in black for the black foot, and I'm gonna use the clear for the clear foot. So the first thing we wanna do once you get it on, I, got, I like where my breakover is, I'm straight, is I'm first gonna purge the first bit of material. It's super important. Now I'm gonna come into my cuffs, and you can see how the, the glue disperses inside the cuff. You use each one of your holes, get the glue to really go in all your cuffs. There we go. We'll go around here. And so there's a gasket on the outside of these cuffs that really holds everything in. Last thing I like to do is go around the outside like this. And it's really hot today, so I'm trying to hustle because all these glues are really temperature dependent. I roll the toe and I roll the toe purposely when I do these so I can put glue in this area. And we're gonna go back to the other cuff over here. Same thing. We're gonna add glue to each, each hole. Totally fill our cuffs. Again, we're gonna go around the outside. All right, buddy. So the last thing we're gonna to wanna to do here is we're gonna wrap it. We don't have to wrap, but it helps push the cuffs nice and tight around the foot.
Last thing is, use your, your wrap. Just kind of push your glue down all the way around. This really pushes, engages that cuff to the foot. And then with this urethane glue, what we want to do is um, leave it on about 10 minutes before we do the last step. All right, now we're gonna do our last step. We're gonna cut off our plastic. So at this point, this is all cosmetic work. You don't really need to do this, but um, it makes it look pretty and it makes you look like you have a very finished job. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start with a rasp. I'm gonna knock off all my high points of the glue. And this is kinda, this saves you work on the buffy side. Go around the other side here. Same thing over here. When you're doing this, you can kind of see the difference between glue and cuff. And obviously we don't want to take away our cuff it makes it strong. Next thing we're gonna to go to our Buffy. With our Buffy, we're just trying to smooth these transition lines. side here. Finish them up. Alright, now the last thing we're going to do steps here and pull off all the dust I did the right front so. and then the last thing we're gonna do is we're gonna seal everything up with super glue again this is an important step seals everything up makes it look really nice And again, a lot of the, these last steps are just cosmetic. I think the super glue really helps keep everything together. Rub this in nice. And obviously don't put them in shavings or grass or anything before you let the super glue set. There we go. We got our two front feet done.